Oh, I see. Um, do you have all your cards? Because I do not have all my cards. Um, but, 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 yeah, I'm still testing it on EDO Pro. I'm still trying to figure out main deck version three. I'm trying to figure out what I want to use because that is not going to be a deal. Um, sure, why the hell not? We'll just use version two right now. I don't even know if this is going to work. Oh, no. Why did this not activate? Hmm. Same original. T ah. Oh. What the hell? Oh, shit. Hello! GG, GG on the first one. <laughs> uh, so I'm probably going second.
Yes, sir. Wow, I didn't draw anything. Shit. <laughs> ah, I didn't draw anything. So it's two draws. Normal summon. Okay, that drawing is coming up. Two.
Jeff and Natasha do that. I didn't read that. Miss Blade. Oh, what can I activate? No. I had a good feel, too. Dang. GG. <laughs> oh, I don't know what keeps. I forgot about future. Should I have attacked then? Should I just let that? So this is a quick effect. That was the thing that got me. This is a quick effect to special summon. So you can do that on your opponent's turn. If I knew that, I would have, because I knew who it was attached to. I didn't know it was a quick effect. So yeah, that's, that's game for that one. So that quick effect one. And then Titanion, I actually should have just crashed into him instead. Or I should have just left my card out. But there was really nothing. What was this, Dark Magician? Yeah, I only played three cards. Like, there's nothing really I could do on that setup. Because I had rivals. Could have waited, renewed. Or I could have just let Dark... That's what I should have done. I should have... I shouldn't have attacked, which is fine. Um, so what do I do here? Because <laughs> honestly, if I could have got the Dragoony boy, We can try woos. We don't really need spirit anymore. <laughs> we really just need to get that on. It's fine. I'll go first. Oh, well. Okay. Oh. Activate. Normal summon. Link. Activate. Boom.
<laughs> Don't have back row removal. <laughs> uh... GG's, let's go. Good stuff, good stuff. Right at 10.15 too. Yeah, that's the thing about matches, man. I've always had a summon limit in my side deck. Um. So yeah, yeah, that was a good stuff. Full power Utopias. But nope, I, I do have a meta-ish side deck. I really do. But good stuff, Patrick. And side note, return to... YouTube kind of with you dueling so that was that was smooth but um the second game <laughs> I got you but the second game I actually messed up because what I should have done thank you what I should have done is I never should have attacked with Dark Magician that was my problem. I attacked with Dark Magician. And then I forgot about Hope Harbinger crashing into that. And then you had Future. What I should have done is I should have just left Dark Magician there. Let you go to your turn. Destined Rivals, the field. Then played my, my back row. That's what I should have done. But I didn't do that. I was impulsive and attacked, but but that is how we're gonna end the stream at ten seventeen. I'm actually probably going to uh, go play a little Avengers, see what the missions were, trying to do some, trying to do some things. But yeah, I'm gonna have to rewatch that once this is done. But do some mission stuff, Byron. If you're on PlayStation, gonna hop into the party so we could chat it up a bit. But thank you everyone who. Oh, before I do close. Close the L7C Yu-Gi-Oh! stream, which, again, I know we always say we'll be bringing some Yu-Gi-Oh! back. Uh, we've just been super into Avengers right now and the podcasting and all that. But, yeah, I will be back dueling some more. Had the counter trap set then, mm, then, yeah, then that would have been either I did not think of the counter trap. But just real quick, because I guess we haven't really talked about it, uh, the new Dark Magician cards. Just real, real quick. So, Magic Karibo. It's cool if you're, uh, yes, sir. It's cool if you're playing in a slower type thing. But it says if you take battle damage. So, if you really want to have this card go off, you can attack. Thank you, Byron. You can attack your opponent or damage from card effects. Playing against Byron, that could help. So that's a that's an iffy one. This will definitely be one of. Um, shoot, Byron can use this in Shadals. This is actually the best card. And every Dark Magician deck I've been seeing, they've been running three of these minimum. Because this card is super good. Just reveal, add any Dark Magician or non-ritual monster that lists Dark Magician. It's too good. You can add, you can reveal this, add um, rod. Reveal this, add souls. Like this is the card. But and that's what I've been contemplating. If I would take out fake dark magician and run this to make more consistency. So still been working with that. And then the fusion. 
one chaos or black i hope they unveil new chaos monsters in um battles of chaos because that would be really cool and then this one's just an og throwback to uh get magical dimension magical dimension was super good to me back in the day because that was able to get around stardust dragon with magical dimension special summon a spellcaster from your hand then you could destroy one card on the field Stardust Dragon couldn't negate that because you had to negate the initial part of Magical Dimension. So that was that was cool. But we'll see, man. I'm working on that stuff on um, EDO. Hoping they can get to Nexus so I can play them. But then got the illusion there. And that. So we're going to be testing some stuff out. But with that being said, thank you all for watching the L7C stream. We will be back. Um... I had a podcast come up about SummerSlam. Going to have the NXT one coming out probably tomorrow. Uh, got two recordings with the Captain Byron tomorrow. Got a Naruto What If Battle this Sunday. Got a lot of stuff coming. So thank you all for watching the duels and keep on dueling everyone. And anyone who watched, 